I, oh, censor that part out. Yeah, that's going. Oh, you mean I can't count on you? No. Good. Welcome, welcome. Here we are again. Here we are. Seems like you live here now. <laughs> as long as I, I don't pay rent. Left, I thought you kicked out 30 years like, ago. Yeah, at least 30, right? Or maybe not 30 years ago. <laughs> A few years anyway. So yeah. yeah. No, yeah, just come back to visit, you know. <laughs> okay, well, that's fair enough, yeah. <laughs> and okay. to bring bring joy to your life. Oh, right? wow, there you go. I guess that's a, <clears throat> a plus. <laughs> Today should be... I don't know about a guaranteed winner, but it's uh, we're going to watch a director that we've seen uh, two of his movies so far. How did I do with them? You liked them both. That's, oh, that's why I'm cool. thinking it's almost a guaranteed winner. Well, you know, that's not... That's not that's I know. No, we don't want to jinx it. No. Uh, we're watching another movie by John Carpenter. Okay. I don't know if you remember what movies he directed. Any chance? I have the faintest idea. Okay. <laughs> he did Halloween. Okay. And he did The Thing. Oh, okay. Yeah, so this right, is the okay. first one of his we're going to watch that's not a horror film. This mm -hmm. is a science fiction action film, and it's called Escape from New York. New York, cool. Wow. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I've been here a couple of times. Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, you escaped, so you... I, I did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You're already ahead and of the I, game I may never be, I don't know if I'll ever get back there. No. Well, Probably not. It's hard to say. Oh, uh, you'll recognize a couple actors in this one, and uh, I think you'll like it. Okay, we'll find out, I guess, won't we? Yeah, Escape I can, from New York. Should I, why, why we bother? We'll just give it a thumbs up now and we're finished. <laughs> Let's go! Your hearing aid switched over? Uh, you want to hear this music? It's great. <laughs> <laughs> it's one of the things John Carpenter's known for is his hey, music. Uh, he writes it himself. Yeah. Kurt Russell. Yeah, works with the people he likes. Kurt Russell's one of them. Oh, Lee, too. Yeah. <laughs> Heard of him, too. Mm-hmm. Did a lot of westerns, a lot of spaghetti yeah. westerns. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sporgnine. It's that TV show he was in, a captain on a boat or something. <laughs> um, McHale's Navy. Yeah, right. <laughs> That's pretty high. Yeah. The once great city of New York becomes the one maximum security prison for the entire country. <laughs> I don't remember that happening. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Better turn around. Oh, well. There's Kurt. Uh, got a bad eye, eh? Yeah. Terminate and be cremated on the premises. If you elect this option, notify the... You know, a little welcoming committee. Yeah. I don't know how welcoming they are. Well, uh, but they're there. It's the president. Yeah. That's Air Force One. Yeah. <laughs> He's got his own little, uh, <laughs> escape egg. Now they get up in the air, eh? <laughs> right? Yeah. You come back in, he dies. Hmm. Uh, sure, a little visit. Yeah, right? I didn't get to see any of the sights. Mm -hmm. Not much there to... No, that's true. A little rubble down that spot, anyhow. <laughs> we can. If we move in with choppers, they'll kill him. <laughs> An old revolver. Ah, <laughs> uh -huh. The president was on board. President of what? <laughs> <laughs> I don't like meals. <laughs> Two microscopic capsules lodged in your arteries. They're already starting to dissolve. <laughs> Just big enough to open up both your arteries. <laughs> no more snake pliskin. <laughs> oh, you mean I can't count on you? No. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. 
There he is. <laughs> yep. You don't want to walk around down there, Snake. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. President, I'm the president. <laughs> I, I knew when I, I got this thing, I, I'd be president. <laughs> yeah, but I heard you were dead. <laughs> This is radio. Mm -hmm. Where you going, buddy? <laughs> this stuff is like gold around here, you know. It's like gold. <laughs> Heard you were dead. Everybody hears he's dead. <laughs> Don't call me Harold. <laughs> <laughs> A couple chandeliers. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. Mm. Oh, back through it again? I guess so. Let's see why you wouldn't want to take Broadway. It doesn't go through. Oh, yeah. <laughs> My brain. Hold on. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Duke told us to wait inside. He's on his way here now. He didn't say nothing to us about it. Oh. <laughs> there he goes. He's always sniffing around like a dog. Comes up with the gas. <laughs> <laughs> what are you looking at? Ooh. Ooh. Ow. Mm. We've got to move fast. Move fast? You're goddamn right, I'm a fast quiet. Then he's got to get out now. Yeah, it's easier said than done. The hard part of the plan. There are a few of them, huh? Yeah, it's going to be a problem. I heard you were dead. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people thought that, eh? Yeah, the legend is, apparently. Don't move, Snake. Oh, hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he wasn't going over the top. <laughs> well, you both got bats, eh? All right, could be worse. Make it fair, I didn't like that. Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. Ooh, nice shot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just deflated. Oh, boy. Back to the president's gone. Brain took him. Hmm. <laughs> I don't care much about him anymore. Nope. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Just got to find a taxi cab driver, maybe. <laughs> He's got to get up to the top. He's in the World Trade Center oh, now. Oh, right. Yes. That's where his plane is. Yeah, that's right. Or his glider. Oh. Ha ah. ha. Here, take it. Mm-hmm. There he is. <laughs> Good timing. <laughs> Whew. 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, perfectly spaced though. Yeah. Could have wound them and all, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> hmm. He by himself too? Looks like it, yeah. yeah. Not sure why. It's got a whole gang. Okay now. Ooh. Ooh, blown in half. Ooh. Whoops. Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. I said jog right. You asshole. <laughs> Oh, hmm. Poor cabby. Damn it! Oh no! Can't even read his own map. Mm hmm. Rain. I ain't doing too well. Nope. Mm hmm. What you going to kill the duke, eh? Yeah. Might want to save some bullets, but... Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Mm -hmm. oh. Mm -hmm. Your boy's pretty good shape. <laughs> right? He's the president, too, so... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they're not all fat. <laughs> not very presidential looking, but... No. And he's got a British accent, you know. Kind of yeah. unexpected. A minute and 31 seconds. Yeah. Whoop. Oh, no. <laughs> still got the gun and he's still... Yeah. That's kind of a mistake to leave it with them, but there it is. Who's doing that? Oh, what? Come on. <laughs> oh. Another one! Uh, uh. You're the Duke! He must have done it, eh? Yeah. Wanted to make sure he got a shot at the Duke, I guess. All right, bring him up now. He wanted to get the Duke. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's it. Just wanted to make sure you got the Duke. Get these things out of my neck. Oh. <laughs> uh, waiting for your broadcast. Give him a shave. <laughs> <laughs> We'd make one hell of a team, Snake. I'm a team? What did you do? <laughs> right. You're on camera, Mr. President. Good evening. <laughs> oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> so, that was Escape from New York. I gathered that. Yeah. Yeah, I figured right. it out. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can see it was I'm New York and it. they were escaping. Not the New York I remember. <laughs> Boy, they really party different. there that one night, I guess. <laughs> Rip the heck out it's of like it. It's like the day after New Year's. It's January 1st. Oh, and right after the bubble comes yeah. out. Yeah, the big yeah. ball or whatever. It's, apple, it's all whatever. broken apple. apple pieces everywhere. Yeah, right. Holy God, there sure was. Anyhow. <laughs> yeah. uh, well, pop quiz. You're the pop. Here's oh. your quiz. Hmm. So... There was a sequel to this one about 16 years later, 15 years later, doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. And it was set in, it was Escape From, and it was another major U.S. city. What city do you think it would have been? Los Angeles? You got it. Yep. Escape From L.A. There yeah. you go. <laughs> All right. So, um... Can I get a bonus for that? Yeah, right? you can a raise? A... I get a raise, I heard. <laughs> Just shower oh. you with money. Uh. <laughs> 
I mean, put your monopoly money back in your pocket. <laughs> so I think that as a, this is our third John Carpenter movie, mm -hmm. and if you've seen now that you've seen a few, you can see some of his hallmarks of what he likes to do. Um, uses the same actors like Kurt Russell there from The mm -hmm. Thing. Yeah. From Halloween, he's got Donald Pleasance, who was the president in this one. He was a doctor in that one. Right. The uh, one of the guys, the the military guy, was um, the 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 cop in Halloween. Oh. Yeah, doesn't really matter. And I think, and Adrian Barbeau, who was Maggie, the woman who ended up dying on the bridge. Yeah, she sure did. Yeah, yeah she was at the time his partner, his girlfriend. I don't think they were married. And uh, Kurt Russell, um, the girl in the restaurant, the Chock Full of Nuts restaurant. Oh, yeah. That was Season Hubley, and she was at the time his wife, I think. Yeah, yeah just before Goldie Hawn. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I mean, they anyways. They all in the family, didn't they? Well, they do, they do. Oh, they <laughs> all they need is Eddie Bunker there, or whatever it is. <laughs> Charlie Bunker, what the hell? I'm sure who you mean. All in the family? Oh, all in the family, yes. Uh, <laughs> Um, Archie, Archie Bunker. Like a bunker. Part yeah, of you guy. got the bunker right. I had a whole bunch of and first names. His for him. wife was named Edith, so there was an yeah. Eddie, you know. Yeah, yeah. Meathead. <laughs> and Meathead. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and that one, that movie was very influential around science fiction at the time um, and going forward. Okay. I it, showed you The Road Warrior and mm -hmm, that mm -hmm. sort of, the, the, the punk rock style um, future post-apocalyptic thing, mm -hmm. that the look of those people with like the mohawks and everything yeah. what went forward, but not everybody had access to a desert. And if you remember Road Warrior, there were a lot of like, it wasn't a destroyed city. It was like a rebuilt something, right? Mm -hmm. So they this style of like d destroyed city, a city with rubble everywhere, broken walls, all that stuff, spray paint everywhere. That was like the, the world that the Road Warrior people in ripoff movies that Italians made, the, that was the world they lived in. So oh. this world inspired a lot of um, rip-off movies, and the, the look of those characters from Road Warrior inspired the look of the people. Oh, okay. So they had a lot to do with um, a lot of the way that low-budget science fiction going forward oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And those films, of course, influence people who make movies now, so you'll see it kind of come back around to that a little bit. Okay. Yeah. That's all right. It's hard to tell sometimes whether those people were zombies or not. <laughs> well, I mean... I think some I mean, of the, the gangs, people, not the robot one. No, no, yeah. I know what you mean. Like some of them were um, definitely like there were definitely different levels of of savagery. I guess but there was talk of cannibalism. I don't know if anybody was doing it. He said hmm. something about your the president's probably eaten by now. Oh right. Okay. Whether or not it was, you know, he's only been there for five minutes when he said it, so yeah. it's not like he would be the expert on it. Yeah, but, it might have uh, been. Yeah. There was definitely different levels of, uh, of of savagery amongst the people there. Yeah. So. Uh, what did you enjoy about it? What were the parts that you liked? It's a funny movie for me to, to, to really get into. Okay. Yeah, yeah. At the beginning, it really, it's very slow at the beginning. Yeah. And that's okay. Then it moved on, and I wasn't quite sure exactly what was going on. <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh, but it kind of moved along, and it, you know, kind of got into a, I guess the, once they started coming up from the sewers, Okay. That got a little more exciting, a little more movement going on and that sort of thing. And I think it got, it got better from there, you know, from my mm -hmm. enjoyment point of view. And, uh, yeah, what, <laughs> I, what the Latin was, the ending was really quite good. And I really liked the old uh, president. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that, I thought, I thought if he had a big bushy blonde head of fake hair, I would call him Trump. <laughs> Crazy man with a gun would do that. You know, you know, you're not far off. I'm sure that, uh, you know, he could like shoot somebody on Fifth Avenue or whatever he said. Yeah, unfortunately, this was 1981. Yeah, yeah. A little before even, uh, well, well, Trump is around probably. But he wasn't as famous yet. No, he would just probably be ripping people off in New York. <laughs> Snake got him at the end. He got the tape and he was going to make this big speech. And all of a sudden, this <laughs> different kind of... Yeah. You yeah. <laughs> could see him, the smile fade away slightly. <laughs> so the ending was, was, was pretty good. Yeah, and he anyway, got to... I mean, they were, they were screwing him, so yeah, he, yeah, he screwed yeah. them, right? Yeah. And he kind of needed to after everything they did to him there. Yeah, wow. <laughs> 
Yeah, well, he, yeah, he got through it. He got through yeah. it with, what, seconds to spare. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And I mean, assuming their timer was yeah. dead on, we don't know for sure, but... You oh, know, yeah, it was right on. Well, yeah, he oh, would yeah, have been dead. Start he would have away. Yeah. He would have popped both his yeah. arteries and he would have been and He done. was waiting for it, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, checking his timer, you know, making sure they turned him well, off. Well, you could see him waiting for it. Yeah. Yeah, is it going to happen or not going to happen? It didn't happen. He didn't even just started walking away. I love the way Lee Van Cleef steps in and like stops him from giving him the the, the antidote before yeah. he gets the tape, right? Right, like, right, just, right. Yeah, just that's true. That's extra true. scummy, right? <laughs> yeah, he, I don't know what his role was. What did he he what? was the, the chief of police, right? So the, the police were like, the surrounded them, so they were essentially prison guards. Okay. And he was the commissioner of police, so he was okay. the highest level. Okay. Yeah. He, so he wasn't a federal guy then. No, Not and really. uh, when, and it was I a think federal prison. But yeah, the guy who uh, who came and like wanted to go in with the helicopters. Yeah. He was federal. At least he worked for the president. That's my impression, anyways. Okay. Yeah. 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 The unfortunate thing about the sequel, besides the fact that it wasn't very good, <laughs> <laughs> I watched that in the theaters. So that's another thing that's unfortunate about it. Yeah. But and it, another unfortunate thing is it essentially just does the same story. Like, yeah, it hmm. just kind of basically does the same story. I mean, there's a few little differences. Yeah. Okay. Um, but it, you know, and uh, one big difference that big uh, baseball bat wrestle um, scene oh, where yeah. they're fighting. Yeah. They changed that into a basketball game. For the yeah, I don't know. Anyways, but well, the, Americans play basketball. That's yeah. true. Lots that's of, true. You know, <laughs> white men can't jump. I've heard. I've heard. Yeah, I've well, that. I actually Russell watched that. Well, Kurt Russell. Oh, when recently? Or? Oh, years and years oh, ago. I'm shocked. Okay. Yeah, well, there you go. Another movie you've seen. Yeah, that was probably number two on the list. That one, Rocky Horror Picture Show. So, Rocky Horror Picture Show. Tell me. Uh, I we didn't get into it when we talked about it. What did you think of it? Did you enjoy it? It was funny. Yeah, it was. It's funny. Yeah. And, you know, and they, good music. Yeah, the good music. Uh, Probably yeah, and it, being part of the theater where they get involved. And yeah. It was just a little small theater. Just in town here. Yeah, I know which one town. plays it every week on, every year on like I Halloween, I think. Yeah, and it was really cool. Yeah. Yeah, it's a and fun people, experience. You know, what, water Getting pistols. water pistols. And 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 yeah. yeah. A lot of people in costume. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, well, oh, but uh, the last thing that was disappointing about uh, Escape from L.A., the the, se the sequel to this, mm -hmm. um, Donald Pleasance, the president, mm -hmm. dead in real life. Yep. Lee Van Cleef, the, 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 the prison, the commissioner of yep. police, dead in real life. So, I mean, it was Kurt Russell, but it would have been nice to kind of see him interact with some of these right, characters. Right, right. Yeah, that wouldn't be quite the same then no. as a sequel. you got to have at least, well... You kind of have more than just one main star. <laughs> it would be nice. It would have yeah. been nice, right? Well, and they yeah. did bring back the, the second in command to Lee Van Cleef, a guy named Tom Atkins, an actor named Tom Atkins. He's in it, but I mean, it's yeah, it's he's not quite been, yeah. He no, was a secondary not. actor in this. Yeah, one. he was secondary. He was like mm. the one. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Well, that's Anyways. all right. But Sometimes they win, sometimes they lose. That's true. That's yep. true. And yep. I mean, at least they got to make the movie. I mean, that's people right. were waiting for that sequel, and it finally got made. And did they a little make any money? I wonder. Not enough to do a third one. They were going to do a third one, and I think they even announced it at the end, oh, like yeah, over the yeah. credits, like yeah. Snake Plissken will return in, mm -hmm. I think it was Escape from the Earth, either Escape <laughs> from the Earth or Escape from the Moon, one of those two, okay. but it never, it hasn't happened yet. They Good, did some I'm comics glad. and I'm stuff. Glad. I know, it doesn't need a third one, no, and no. we're not going to watch the second one. It's uh, it's not very good. And right, <laughs> I don't, I don't want to watch the No, second. I agree. I, I would walk. I would probably... Walk out. Well, no, I wouldn't walk out. I'd probably just roll over and <laughs> go to sleep. <laughs> go to sleep or something. Yeah. Turn my hearing aids off. I would have a good little It would be good sleep. Wake bad. me up when you were leaving. Yeah, I know that seems fair. That <laughs> seems like the right thing to do. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, anything else we need to say about I Escape from New York? I don't think so. Like I said, I wasn't, I was a little, I wasn't quite sure at the beginning and even partway through. But it did, it did keep my interest enough and it was interesting enough and entertaining enough. So, yeah. Yeah, it was, it was. It actually had a deleted scene at the beginning. You know how they mentioned that he robbed the Federal Reserve? Yeah. That, that's what he was in for? Oh, okay. They actually included that. Oh, okay. And I feel like it would have slowed the movie down, but it mm. would have brought Snake in earlier. So it's kind of almost... But I, I, I've never seen the scene, actually. Okay. I've read it because it's in the novelization of the script, which right. I have read. Right. But uh, I, I think they've only... Uh, there was like a documentary or something that included like a few seconds of it, but mm. I've never actually seen the scene. Interesting. Yeah. So well, anyways... like yeah, I, I might get a little excitement at the end but it would have drawn it out more yeah it would have the beginning i said originally was a little bit it would have slowly. just made it longer right at the yeah. beginning which would have been bad but maybe it might have helped to bring 
and sneak so, in earlier. Yeah. We'll never know. Yeah. This is the version we saw. <laughs> we have to go and on And I'm that. happy with it. I'm a fan. Okay. But let's see how you vote. So we're going to do our vote. Escape from New York? It's close. Hey, it was close, close, but it gets there. That's yeah. all right. John yeah. Carpenter's, a, you know, three for three so far, so that's pretty good as a Yeah, director. I'm going to shake his hand and ask him for an autograph when I see him. <laughs> Is he coming to the next showing? I think, well, I'd like to. That'd be great, but yeah. I don't know. <laughs> well, yeah, I thought you had pull with these guys. If we, if we Why don't I sit around and listen to you talk about I these know, guys right? and you don't have any influence on them? I don't even know them. them. Oh, well, if we go to we're L.A., not... we'll, we'll try and meet them. We'll we see were there happens. earlier. <laughs> Anaheim. We were in Anaheim. Yeah, That's yeah. He might have come up and saw us, and yeah. we knew we were there. He's still alive. He makes music. He oh, directs. Right. doesn't direct anymore, but he makes music. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks, everybody, for watching. Uh, let us know if you're a big fan of Escape from L.A. I'd like to know if there's actually anybody out there who is. <laughs> Maybe Don't. more than two of us. <laughs> well, well, two for Escape from New York. Oh, right, right, Escape right, from right, L.A., right, yeah. I don't oh, think, right, right. I don't know. Don't, don't, don't. Don't poke me on that lot. Yeah. Just, uh, <laughs> there may not be two. That's right. That's yeah. right. Maybe less than that. Uh -huh. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and uh, see you again. See you next, next week. Bye.